There are few things in the universe that are both fantastic and horrific. One of those things is fire. It helps create much of our world, but it can also destroy it. Decades ago, inventors came up with smoke detectors for our homes that have saved untold numbers of lives and properties. But what if you can't hear that beeping smoke detector? Well, now there's an innovation that can give you a quake if you can't hear the alarm to wake. Here's Jax Tranquita to explain. Put two fingers on each electrode, and you notice it turn green? Yes. You can count on one hand the number of innovators we've featured more than once on this program. And one of them is Dr. David Albert. After receiving his MD and degree in biomedical engineering from Duke University, he became a serial inventor and so far has 80 US issued patents to his name. Previously, you learned about his Cardia Mobile invention, a personal EKG that works with a smartphone, allowing for self-detection of heart arrhythmias. He's also the inventor of the Lifetone vibrating fire alarm and clock. It was important for me to build this because we wanted this to be able to notify or wake up people no matter if they had a little bit of hearing, poor hearing, or no hearing at all. I met Dr. Albert in Los Angeles to learn about the life-saving technology that will shake you to wake you if you don't hear the alarm. So tell me about some of the different components, like what's happening up here? This is the hearing aid for when you're asleep, and it's your ears if you're deaf. The device uses sophisticated sound processing to listen, and it functions in conjunction with standard smoke alarms, which issue a temporal three or T3 pattern of three beeps followed by a pause. So this is actually the part that takes in that information that people that are hard of hearing can't, those three beeps that we all know as danger. Yes, this is the ear. It has the vibrational or tactile alarm. It also has a very unique audible alarm, and then it also uses voice. This is the bed shaker. This is a very big motor that takes 12 volts to generate. Can you show me how it works? Sure. Love to demo it. Let me start an alarm. That's a regular smoke alarm sound. <laughs> Fire! Get out! Oh, wow. That is a strong vibration. That would wake me up from, from the depths. <laughs> and as you heard, it had a very loud alarm. It also had fire get out in English and Spanish. And then on the display, it said fire. That tabletop demo sure got my attention. But in real life, the alarm would be used in the bedroom while you sleep, the shaker being placed either under a pillow or a mattress. Let's demo it. Go ahead, put it under the pillow, and I'm going to set off a simulated smoke alarm. I'm like bracing. Oh. <laughs> Wow, that is powerful. Oh, oh I am a deep sleeper. I would not sleep through that. 